I think if I had known what I do now at the time of when I opened my call and um, that whole journey, um, I think I probably would just tell myself to take it all in stride. I mean, that's kind of cliche, but um, you have a lot of crazy expectations and things that you think will happen. Um, and I would kind of just discard those. Um, not that you can't hope for, for great experiences and, and fun things to happen. Um, but I would just take it as it comes. Um, I think so often my mission president would say a lot that um, the adversary tries to get us to either live in the past or the future to dwell on um, happy or sad things in the past or to anticipate future with anxiety and stuff like that. And so um, one of the hardest things, things I think as a human, let alone a missionary, is to be in the moment and to just live for today and in the present. Um, but I think that's that's really important as a missionary um, because it's so easy to to get stressed out and to have a lot of anxiety <laughs> And about because you love you love what you're doing you love the people that you're working with and you care so much about them that um, you can start worrying about them and what's going to happen and if a baptismal drop dates uh, or a baptismal date drops or stuff like that can be stressful but um, you kind of just have to let it roll off and just <laughs> attain some sort of zen state on your mission um, and that's hard but. The, the way to do it is just to leave it in the Lord's hands and realize that you don't have much control. That's something that I had to come to terms with um, and just kind of let the control go. Because um, sometimes I tend to be perfectionist, um, have perfectionist tendencies maybe and um, want to control things. But on a mission, you just can't do it because you're dealing with people and they have struggles and they have their own life. Um, and sometimes they'll they'll fall or they'll give, they'll give up, but sometimes they won't. Sometimes they'll they'll make it. But you have to just trust that whatever happens, um, these people are in the Lord's hands and they have their agency. And um, so I think just going into your mission, just have that in mind, and don't stress yourself out too much. Um, when you when you get to your end of, on end of your mission, I can guarantee that you'll you'll want to stay and that you'll miss it and that you'll love the English people. So just, just take it in stride and enjoy it.